you, talking to 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 I thought Ilmac was from Portland. Oh, just oh, L.A. Okay, okay just L.A. All right. LA. Oh, and I thought you said the, I thought you said LST. You said L.A. Then yeah, then we got it. All right, no Ilmac. He ain't in L.A. And no one neither. Yeah, and Nitty neither because he's from Arizona. So then yeah, we got Day Diddy, Day Diz, myself, Danny, and B Dot. B Dot from from Pequena, that's L.A. County. Hmm. Hmm. That's a strong five. Well, Rum Nitty is stronger, but he's from Arizona. That's a decent five. I'm trying to think. Out of their five, who y'all think is the weakest link? I mean, Barlow. Oh, Barlow probably be. Yeah, I was going to say, like, if it's bar wise then you'll probably say,
What about twerk? Mm-hmm. Twerk, twerk, twerk. That nigga be choking. Be twerk. Yeah, and he be choking too. So twerk would be, to me, is like he would be right now probably their hottest one, though. You know what I'm saying? Like he would be like, you know what I'm saying? He would like probably be their hottest one. So whoever they match him up against, they got to make, so make it count. You know what I'm yeah. saying? They got to make it count. You know what I'm saying? His battle might determine the way everything falls for him. You know what I'm saying? I think work is, better, is, is hotter than Old Red right now. Yeah, I'm really so. cool. Yeah. I mean, I mean, I, I, I think yeah. so. Even though Old Red, like, he got that, that win over core, you know, the, the, the debatable with DNA, depends on how you call it, you know what I'm saying, with that battle. You know what I'm saying? I just feel like the twerk battles is with with the uh, with Verb and Shug, you know what I'm saying, and, and all of them, like, they just, it's still just being a little bit more electrifying. It's still just being like he's still ending up having these battles of the night after the shit. You know what I'm saying? The more it's over about battles. No, I was saying the L. Will battle too. Yeah, you right about yeah. that. The J.C. Yeah. battle. Yeah, like he's been on the road. You can't really deny him. He's been taking a lot of them vests out too, man. Salute to work, man. He's been, he been, he been on his new era shit. You know what I'm saying? He ain't ducking no smoke. You know so it was just, so, so, so the top is twerk, then comes the old red. After that, you still got surf, Suge, and Arsenal. Yeah, we well, I think that rounds it out, honestly. That'll round it out. Yeah. Who, who out of them five. three right there? Wait, out of them three right there, who you got out of them three that can beat B dot clearly? Oh, I could beat B dot. None. None. I don't think Arsenal be in beat out, man. Not right now, today. And Arsenal, one, and Surf and Arsenal, two of, two of my favorite battlers coming up. You know what I'm saying? Like, I fuck with both of them, especially coming up. Like, I watch them both. Like, but this moment, I don't know, because B-Dot in a different bag, man. I really don't see a lot of niggas beating him at this very yeah. moment. He like him at the bronze stage where bruh just, he really just be talking that shit, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? They got to be honest. Niggas be hating on him and not really giving him his full credit. Like, he damn near one of the best in the game right now. Like, ain't no tear, just he's That's one of the fact. best in the game. That nigga is like, master. He's a master level writer. I just got yeah, off the phone real. with him. I'm like, damn, bro, who who can really who really can see you with that pen, man? I'm like, yo, man, what's up with Lux, man? What the fuck? Like, he talking, you know, he talking about, he, you know, he looking at JC right now or some shit like that. And I, That's cool. That's cool, but I mean, really, but you gotta see B-Dot. line for line. Yeah, you gotta see. If you, man, yeah, B Dot is that master level writer, and it's not that many battlers in the whole game of battle rap that are at a yeah, master right, level. Right and I'm looking at his yeah, third round yeah. versus uh, Mike P, Mike and I'm P. like, damn, dog. Like, I'm like, who, who is saying this type? Of shit? Even if you don't agree with the content, and not everybody's into the black countries in the in the in the and this and that and third, they not into that. But just from a lyrical standpoint, just the way he put that fine. shit together is like yeah. unmatched. It is, it's is down there unmatched, man. I ain't. I don't. Who else doing that? That's all I'm saying. Who else is doing that? I can't think of nobody. That's what I'm saying. Like, yeah, like that dude is like. That's what I'm saying. You ain't got nobody to beat out on, just... in Jersey. Not right now, man. The whole Jersey don't got nobody for B dot. You know what? I'm I'm trying to think. Is there some way Shug or Surf can get around it? There's no way at all, right? Nah. I can see Shug. I can see Shug trying to, you know, the the bully and boom, but but B dot ain't no back down type of dudes. You know what I'm saying? So it's gonna be, you know, yeah, like it's gonna be you no know, bumping back. It's gonna, you know, what I mean, the aggression gonna be there. You know what I'm saying? I think he haven't had no opponent that brung that all the way out of him. So that, you know what I mean? So a lot of people probably don't even look at him like that. But B Dot ain't no stand down type of individual. You know what I'm saying? Like he definitely not backing down. So I think if he had a battle like Suge and them, you would see maybe a different side of what he'll bring. You know what I mean? Like how I say, different opponent bring out different shit. Like he ain't gonna rap the same or have the same aggression against the Emerson that he would have to bring with a Suge. But I definitely think lyrically like, it would already be a different level with Suge, you know what I'm saying? Like, because B-Dot definitely on a different level lyrically. But like I say, mm-hmm. I know Suge do got different attributes. Like, can't take that, like I say, can't take that type of shit away. Suge is a performer. He know how to win a round. You dig what I'm saying? He can he can captivate the crowd, and he done been here. So I never say he couldn't win a round or do some shit like that against anybody, but I just feel like 
three rounds complete after you break it all down and watch it fully, like three rounds, like right, the type of anger right. that you got to come with and shit like that. It's like you're going to be like, nah, like once you finish watching it, like, like nah, be down the type of nigga talk to you. It's like a lust or a, and all that. Like it's, when y'all, it's the same way. It, I feel like when you say when you pick lust against people, they always be like, well, nah, I don't know that the angles and shit, they, it's, it's tough to beat that. Same with Mook. I nobody got verb really beat Mook. It's the same way with like a beat out. It's like, man, you know, you ain't really seen nobody stop him when he come with his with his angles. Like I can't really say nobody beat him. Like I, he damn near undefeated. You know what I'm saying? People be trying to make some of those matchups debatable, but you really honestly be like, you can't really say nobody clearly ever beat him from Verb to Low Soda, Strict to right. Cortez. From me, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah it ain't, it ain't happening. Battle. He ain't yeah. got clearly beat. Every yeah, every battle that you battle. can say lost, it's an argument on why he won. You know what I'm saying? So exactly. like. That's like the that's what like skill wise he he may be in the top five of in the whole game period, you know Real what I'm saying? Shit. You would probably say you know we're talking about just off pure skills. B dot hey. gotta be up there, way up there. Real talk. Real talk. That man is scary good. He's Real scary. He's dangerously good. Real talk. What what's going on with um? All right. So daylight. Y'all still got Daylight, and then y'all got Diz. I would think Diz may be the weakest link on y'all team. At this point, Diz ain't really been himself in a long time, or at least been really winning in a long winning in a long time, now that I think about it. I don't know when the last time Diz won a battle was. I think, was I, I think with Diz, it's the thing that we talked about earlier, man. It's, that, it's, the, it's the motivation of the opponent. I, I feel like he's been in the game so long and down there done battle everybody. You know what I'm saying? Like he doesn't battle niggas like Cassidy. You know what I'm saying? So when you give him, you know what I mean, anybody, like it's tough to probably get that, that total motivation. But if he was motivated, which I think a car like this and all of us knowing what it meant would be the motivation to be there and a, a motivated, because we, we, we talk, we're talking from that standpoint. Maybe he won't be there. But we just, we talking to everybody on their A game, surf, to this, to me, to twerk, we saying no chokes, no stumbles. Everybody on their A game. We we looking in a perfect world. A game Diz is still one of the most dangerous battle rappers in this shit too. You know what I'm saying? He can freestyle. Did what I'm saying? Like he just seemed to catch up and muster. Like he not not even trying to be funny, but like he got the yeah, whole yeah, world yeah. talking yeah, about catch up is the best battle rapper. Like you know what I'm saying? Like this motherfucker can rap, like, you know what I'm saying, with them similes and just most, like, he like a fucking Eminem up there with the words, you know what I mean? So, it's like, on his A game, like, he can really beat anybody. You know what I'm saying? So, we, we def- it's definitely like who they would put against him on their A game would be, it would have to be whoever they felt was their strongest, you know what I'm saying? Like, so it would damn near have to be Diaz versus, like, Twerk at that time. You know That's what I'm saying? Yeah, Twerk or Red, it would have to be. You know what I'm saying? Damn, y'all yeah, niggas yeah, yeah. crazy. I'm trying to figure out. They wanted some cheap wins. They got to tap into who the weakest link is on y'all team, but y'all don't, I guess I'll start a diz. That's what I'm thinking, really, but you said in the A game, I don't really see a weak, a weak-ass link there, man. Danny's not weak. You're not weak. Niggas, man, this is going to be crazy if it was to go down. Yeah, man, we need this to go down, man. Yeah. Got to gotta, gotta tap in with my nigga surf. Like, man, what's going on? How we can make this happen? Tap in. Diz, what up, man? How we can make this happen, man? Who? What card is going on? Beasley, smack somebody, set this up. You know what I'm saying? Jersey versus LA. I think that'll bring the competition back. I think this year in Battle Rap has been a lot of competition. Thanks. You know what I'm saying? I think that'll definitely add to it because a lot of people always want to know, like, what city is dope or, like, you know what I mean? We was on Facebook one day in one of the groups and everybody was saying uh, Jersey or North Carolina or LA, Philly, like, everybody was throwing their cities in there. So I think. That might have sparked something up, L.A. versus Jersey, and you could do motherfucking New York versus North Carolina. You know what I'm saying? Like, it just it switch, switch the game up. You know what I mean? Like, you could do St. Louis versus right. somebody. You know what I mean? And just keep it going. Like, I think that should be crazy. Hell, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I mean at, yeah. at this point. At this like, they could, go, they could throw an actual annual, I will say get rid of double impact, you know what I'm saying? Get rid of that whole shit, you know, because them battles are just, like, more for the entertainment. That's not really, like, super competitive or nothing like that. It's just creative. That's cool. 
get rid of that and do an annual city versus or, or region versus region card. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Michigan versus yeah. St. Louis this year. You know, L.A. versus yeah. Jersey. You know what I'm saying? DMV yeah. versus the, the the South. Just like an annual yeah. card. So the whole get a whole squad together and let them rep where they from versus another. And that's how we're going to start knowing who really is the strongest region without all the back and forth yeah. Twitter shit. Fuck all the back and forth talking. Let's get in there and just yeah. and see. Real talk. Uh, that's right there. That, I mean, yeah, and y'all niggas with y'all versus Jersey would, set, would definitely set it off right there. The wild yeah. thing about it, set it off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we try to set it off now. Yeah, yeah, I, that's 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 I would be the underdog. I'm noticing. Yeah, yeah, I think, I think, I think, yeah, of course, you know, to us, we ain't, but I think on a wide scale, people would probably put us at the underdog. You know what I'm saying? And that's cool, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's, 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 that's all right right there. Niggas ain't really tripping. You know what I'm saying? I understand that. You know what I mean? Right now, the way the fans are set up, I think they would probably have us at the underdog. But I think it's a lot closer than, than on paper. You know what I'm saying? That you would think on paper is real close. But I think in that ring is, is a whole nother level. You know what I'm saying? Like, when you really break it all the way down. You know what I'm saying? It would be different. I think the reason they would have the advantage as far as, like, putting us at the underdog is to just – and some of the certain shit is that, you know, the majority of their artists, you know what I'm saying, is, is all URL-based artists, you know what I'm saying? And so they got, they going to have that, oh, uh, yeah, well, you know, they like only been over there one time, did what I'm yeah. saying, you know what I mean? They, I, I haven't been on the main stage, yeah, beat out, I ain't been on the main stage, you know what I'm saying? It like that is going to be their argument of why we the underdogs. So we, we understand that, but I think when you take all that away and just go strictly on skill, it ain't no way we done the dog. That's true. Okay, okay. Hey, hey B dot man. Someone told me to t- uh, uh, tell you a couple of things real quick. They said number one, you are. The, hey, let me find this shit real quick. And they coming from the perspective of the fan, and they coming from the perspective of he don't want to see you fuck up down the line. <laughs> so he was like, don't don't involve, don't join no groups outside of LSC. What's your thoughts on that? Do you see yourself doing that? Like, you see how niggas join Riders Block and the Goonies, et cetera, et cetera. Do you see yourself just staying in LFC only, or you don't? You never know? And what's your so, thoughts on group period? You talking to me, right, Gotti? Talking to me? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, shit. You know, first and foremost, yeah, salute LFC, man. That squad. First and foremost, my squad coming in the game is the mafia. You know what I'm saying? Now, my niggas right there, man, my own girl, Coffee Brown from San Bernardino, my nigga, a lot of man from my hood in Compton, my nigga, Ron Compton, you know what I'm saying? So, like, I understand that, too, like, as far as, like, being loyal to your side. But I, as far as me, I feel like the, I'm not, the group shit, I, I, I'm not a big fan of just people just being in, you know, groups and, they, you know, just different regions and, they don't know these people. I feel like it. But if you gain the respect, I'm not mad at somebody. So, like, when they did Riders Block, all them dudes met each other and knew each other and, you know what I'm saying, had that respect for each other. So it's different. I mean, it's different to me if you ain't never met a battle rapper or had no type of real, you know, no, right. relationship with them and they just hit you up and be like, hey, yeah, you're part of the crew. All right, for sure, I'm part of the crew. And y'all just like, nah, like, nah, you know what I'm saying? Like, sit at the table, man, chop it up, get to know each other. Like, this nigga might be a weirdo. You know what I'm saying? Like, you feel me? So I ain't mad at niggas, you know what I mean, clicking up, but I think it got to be genuine. You know what I'm saying? And not just doing it for the for the fact that trying to just put battle rappers together just to look like they got a super team or some shit. You know what I'm saying? If it's genuine and niggas really fuck with each other, then go ahead and do it. You know what I'm saying? Okay. He said, all right, dude said, Av was on fire and was the hottest thing in battle rap at one point, but he made some mistakes. He said, uh, Obviously, don't steal and don't oversaturate. What's your thoughts on that? Or, or, like, what's your thoughts on not even stealing, but niggas saying the same bars that this nigga said? I've not, I've, I haven't heard you say something I heard before. I don't hear Danny. He's been rapping fucking forever. I've never heard this nigga say something that other nigga said before. But now we mm-hmm. start to get more and more. So, how the how the hell does that come about? Man, I, I feel like it, it's just like that. You know what I'm saying? Like. A lot of a lot of bars have been said, so I think you got to be careful not to say the same shit as other motherfuckers. Like I just said, a bar. Shout out to um, RP Young, be the future. We got the uh, 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 Benzo Bar Fest channel. 
on YouTube. Subscribe to the channel. It just drops a couple of dope battles. Mine's like Cali Smooth just dropped. Y'all check that out, man. All the proceeds going to a good donation for the Young Be the Future Scholarship Fund. You know what I'm saying? So definitely subscribe to that channel if y'all listening. But I was just going to say, in, the, in that battle, which took place in April, I said some shit about I turn my nose up at you or something. And I think I even said something similar about the nose up against JC. And then I just seen Young Cannon battle with drugs. And he said something like that. Now, neither one of my battles dropped, though. You know what I'm saying? And his battle already dropped. And now the, I think the Kelly's move just dropped yesterday. But uh, neither one of my battles had dropped before he said that. So, like, sometimes people think of the same shit. You know what I mean? So, like, I, I can understand that, you know what I'm saying? Like, like it, it ain't exactly the same what he said, but it, it was still turning the nose up or something like that. You feel me? So, it's like sometimes people might have the same thought. I think it's deliberately still in some time where you could just see, like, a motherfucker was saying it exactly after the battle had came out. Like, this battle was out for, like, a year. You know what I'm saying? And you, and you still came up with that. Then it's like, come on, bro. You had to soul this. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's, or something like you, you either are you subconsciously still it because niggas watch so many battles. Like sometimes when I hear some shit, I'll be like, damn, that's hard. But I'm like, damn, did I hear this shit? Like, let me watch some battles, some of my favorite battles, and see if I ain't taking this shit from a nigga. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like maybe I thought maybe I subconsciously heard this, and now I'm thinking of it or something. So you know, it's so many battles, man. It'd be hard not to think of the same shit, but deliberately still, and I think that shit is to be banned. You should have deduct points for that. But if a motherfucker can prove they ain't still, because I'm pretty sure somebody going to say that I stole uh, the nose up bar. Like I say, it probably was said before that. But I think Cannon just said it recently, and his battle was took, his, his battle happened after both of my battles. I battled in May and April. His battle happened in, like, June, and they dropped it. You know what I'm saying? Like, so, mm-hmm. like, and my battle just dropped, though, in July. You feel me? So it looked like I said it after, but I probably said it months before. You feel me? And he couldn't have took it from me because my shit didn't drop it. He wasn't there. You feel me? So I think sometimes it's a certain situation. I, 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 I hear what you're saying, but there got to be, like, I, there just got to be a way, but it can't just be, oh, he didn't say it word for word, so he didn't steal it. It's a coincidence. Like, a coincidence is shit that rarely ever fucking happened. And it's just, like, this it shit is happening. No, I, I, yeah, no, some niggas be stealing, like, Say a motherfucker say a dope-ass bar, a motherfucker going to probably take it and try to say it in a different way instead of paying homage like, oh, you know what I'm saying? Like, you feel me? Like, instead of paying homage and, and giving credit, like, you know what I'm saying? Like a motherfucker, oh, like Geechee Gotti said, uh, two, uh, t- uh, Tupac, though, you know what I'm saying? On camera, we still think should killed you, and they flip it like, you know what I'm saying? Just like that, the same way we thought should killed you. Instead of saying my name and paying the homage, they'll probably watch that. Think of another way that they could kind of use it and creatively flip it to where it's similar but not word for word. And then it's like, all right, of course you probably stole it, but if you ain't going to gonna say you thought of it on your own. You know what I mean? Like, so it's just, I think a lot of that goes on. You know what I'm saying? I think people wouldn't consider it stealing if you gave, like, homage or something. You feel me? Like mm-hmm. in the bar, you feel me? If you like said where you where you where you reference that from, then niggas would be like give you credit for it. But since people don't do that, then yeah, that's that's stealing. You know what I mean? Okay. And as far as far as you booking your battles, how you doing? How you going about that? I try to space them out, man. I try to space them out. You know what I mean? But sometimes it just end up falling in place to where they be back to back. But like somebody like myself, lately, you know what I mean? Like I learned this just from Danny. I just try to have bars on deck, like I'm constantly writing, so you know what I mean, like you feel me like i'm not no I'm not at work i ain't I ain't got no nine to five and all that like I'm hustling it strictly, you know what I'm saying, I ain't doing nothing illegal man I'm just I sell here and shit you feel me I'm my business owner, you feel me so i i I make my own hours so I can sit down and write raps all day. you feel what I'm saying, so I'm really straight, so like my shit so to me as as long as I'm focused. I'm good, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, it's all about being focused. Like, if I'm focused, then I, I can have two or three battles back-to-back and just focus on them. They don't take no time to really memorize the shit. It's really about getting it wrote out, you know what I'm saying? Like, my memory A1, so once I got it wrote out, it's all good, really, at the end of the day, you know what I mean? So, but I, I, I do look to not be trying to just have battles back-to-back all the time. Like, I think I got some back-to-backs coming up this next month. 
but down the line. But before then, I I never really done that. Like before JC, I didn't have no battles. No, uh, when I was locked up, you know what I'm saying. But I'm just saying, like even before that, before the AV battle, my battle before AV was fucking glue easy. You know what I'm saying? And that was in August. You know what I'm saying? So it was like all, all, all the time I'm trying to really keep it like that to where it ain't really just the battle. And at the half, it was the sores, you know what I'm saying? And like that, yeah. all those battles was like months apart, you know what I mean? Like at least, at least a full month away from the last one. So, you know, that's how I'm trying to keep it, you know what I mean? I don't really, I'm not really into trying to battle every week, you know what I mean? But if you can do it, you can do it. You see, Daddy did a battle and turned around the next day and was ready again. Some people can do it, you know what I mean? If you can do it, and do it, but I don't, I don't, uh, I wouldn't recommend it, you know what I'm saying, on the ring. Right. You know what even, I mean? even, even me, niggas. you know what I'm saying, but I'm, yeah, I'm yeah. like from a whole different breed, but while you was talking <laughs> about the hair, nigga, you need to go sell a motherfucking wig to that nigga Tech Nine, because you took that nigga scalp off, you know what I'm saying, so that <laughs> nigga, need to, uh, he need a whole new wig to be walking around, yeah, man. man. Why you do that, that nigga like that? Me. Yeah, man, the hairboys.com. Yeah, man, the hairboys.com, man. Ladies, if you're listening, if y'all watching this, or fellas, if your girl looking for it, the hairboy.com, man, hit me up. Or hairboy on Instagram, or got he got bundles on Instagram. Yeah, I know this shit for real, man. It's just. It's not a game, man. You know, saying we got it for real. I don't know if they think niggas be joking when they say that in the battle. Nah, we really are selling a bit of hair. Right. Good hair at that. You know what I'm saying? But, nah, man, I just feel like, like I say, as far as oversaturation, I can get that because you don't want the fans to get tired of you. But if you're coming up with consistent material, I don't think it, they can get tired if it's, if it's good. You know what I'm saying? If you continue doing what you're supposed to do up there and you end up there choking and stumbling or just coming with half a right. round, and then it's like you ain't really got to worry about that, but. You know, like, try to, like, space it out, though. You feel me? If you can, if you can help it. You know, I don't know everybody's situation, though. Some niggas be just taking battles for the money. Some niggas taking it for the sports. Some niggas just, you know, taking it for a hobby. So, I me mean, personally, I'm just doing it when they, whenever it comes for the opportunity, really. Ah, that's what it is. Hey, my nigga, I know I had you on here for an hour and shit, man. I'm with you, though, man. appreciate you coming on, though. Yeah, nah, appreciate y'all having me, man. You know what I'm saying? Definitely want to call and talk to my shit, man. Uh... You know, had a good battle at initiation, man. Hopefully, y'all got the uh, on demand video on demand so y'all can see those battles. You know what I'm saying? And, and that's about it, man. I'm finna get up out of here. Yo, how did that with the shit with twerk? Did y'all uh, is they gonna reschedule that for the next big card, or is that some shit y'all still trying to figure out? I don't know, man. We trying to work it out now, man. We trying to work that shit out now, man. That's yeah, man, whack. definitely, man. Got to see that battle, man. That's still a battle I want to see. Man, but anybody else, man, y'all get that VOD, man. Check out those battles. Beat out of Mike P was crazy. UK and Saga was crazy. Nitty and Briz, everybody was in there working drugs and stories. So, yeah, man, I'm gone, man. The mafia, y'all know what it is. LSC, me and this bitch, angry fan. What's the LSC, deal? nigga. I'm gone. I'm gone. Be safe, homie. You ain't talking to you. We see it. to you. I am talking to you. I am talking to you. Talking to you, talking to you, talking to you, talking to you, talking to you.